You're so silly. I need to figure out a way to get over here. Really? Oh, hey. What's going on? <laughs> What's up? <laughs> God, oh gosh. <sighs> he pulled right, he pulled free. The hook never even set any. It's good and sharp, it just never set. Came up and murdered it. Right by the boat, no less. <clears throat> oh gosh. I saw that bass. I saw that bass come and get that. Come here, come here, come here, come here. All right. Whoa, whoa, here we go. Oh, yeah. All right. Second time, second time is a charm. Whoa. <laughs> that was a quick release guys that was a quick release all right had him in my hand dropped him he got back quick he hit it the a fish hit it the first time i couldn't get the hook set on him and uh threw it out there the second time saw him come back after it and inhale it he came up right by the boat that was a beautiful thing I am uh, re-rigging my bait, and I'm gonna throw it out there again, see if I can't catch another one. Thank you. 
in in the UP. This is all I did for like two days straight. Caught a bunch of fish this way. Fish, 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 fish. Boom! Got him, got him. Good one. Good one. Oh yeah, it's a good one. Oh yeah, look at that. Come here. Come here. Ah, yes. Ah, yes. Ah. All right. I'm going to show you this one to you before he hops back in the drink. Hey, if you got them in your hand, they count. <laughs> that is a beautiful fish. They are uh, they're tearing up this white tube jig. I'm just kind of swimming it through like, a, like you would a sluggo or a soft jerk bait. Just, just kind of pulsing it along and they're snatching it. All right, beautiful fish, beautiful fish. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hmm. See a couple out here. Ooh. Oh gosh. All right. Every once in a while, that line breaks. It snapped so hard, I thought the rod broke. I'm glad my rod didn't break. That was a big fish. That was a big one. I don't know. I'm about to catch another one now. See, that's the difference, but the difference between these weeds and the other ones are they're setting out like basically so much deeper. Good God Almighty. Good God Almighty. That is a big one. That is a big one. That is a, that is a nice small mouth. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Come here. Come here. Come here. Oh. Whoa. I'm dropping him in my camera bag. <laughs> right. Camera bag, folks at home. Out of the way. Small mouth. Yeah, that's the way you do it. Goodness gracious. Pop that hook out. That is a beast small mouth right there. All right. 20 plus inch fish. I am uh, fishing in northern Michigan, one of my favorite areas to fish in the crystal clear waters in northern Michigan. Pulling along a tube bait, a white tube bait, kind of sluggo style. They are nailing it on the outside of these reeds. Beautiful fish, take a look at that. Oh yeah, and he's going home. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. Thank you for watching today's episode of Fishing with Joe. Had a lot of fun catching huge smallmouth here in northern Michigan. Caught some, lost some, dropped some, and they flopped off the side of the boat. It's all good. It is. It's all good, especially when you're out and you're having fun doing it. All right. So I hope you enjoyed the show and uh, you picked up a couple techniques. 
um, a white tube jig fished instead of a sluggo. Very, very effective for smallmouth bass. I use mine weightless and uh, that gives the bait a little more action. It does. All right, so you throw it out, let it sink, let that rod tip get low or let it sink down, keep that rod tip low and just twitch it along and it'll just kind of dart entices the strike. All right, little knowledge for you. Thanks for watching the show. See you next time.